it's time to wrangle up some cattles. It's going to be a fun one. We're going to be working 97 head, actually 97 pair. So if you add up the cows and calves, it's going to be almost 200. We're going to be going to four different spots. We kind of started here at home getting them up. We're going to head over to my place, get those up. It's going to be fun. We're going to be using about three different air equipped systems today. Dad is at Storeless Station picking up some stuff right now. He's getting some pour and then a pink eye shot. Now we could be planting beans right now, but you know we've been having a little trouble with pneumonia and we wanna stop that in its tracks. And Merck Animal Health just sent this out. This is their brand new Nasalogen 3 PMH. I believe it's the first respiratory vaccine that has both viral protection and bacterial. We need all we can get because we've been having trouble. It's, we're in a drought, calves are breathing in that dust and that clogs stuff up so then the viruses can get deeper into the lungs. That's what mucus is good for. If it's wet in there, they can cough it up. Well, this dust is making it harder for them to do that. So we're gonna do a bunch of stuff. Number one, we're gonna shoot this in their nostril. Number two, we're gonna be pouring them for flies and lice. Number three, we're gonna be giving them that pink eye shot so hopefully they don't get pink eye out on the pasture. Now we're working multiple groups and this kind of vaccine you got to mix it and then after you mix it you really only have an hour before you start losing effectiveness you know those bugs in there kind of start dying we're going to be working groups as fast as we can that way we can get to the next one and get that stuff in them before it starts dying in there We got the cows up. We're gonna run the cows through first, try to keep the calves in the back, and then we're just pouring the cows, treating anything that needs it. say that's some dang good grass look at that must yeah. bunch of snow must have sat there So the first 22 are worked, we're going to head home, we already got those next 22 up, and we'll get them through the chute. And then we'll 
take a little break probably maybe probably not Sorting went well. Love working cattle here at home. Best facilities. We're gonna run these cows through, pour them, and then get the babies up just like last time. We got group two done and now we're gonna grab the 18 pairs that are out grazing corn stalks we watered them earlier today we're gonna let them sit here drink out of the barn they're gonna be hot and we want to get them up before we start working the next group because like i said once we mix that 50 dose bottle of vaccine we got to use it quick so we want everything ready to go basically a straight shot right from the corn stalks all the way up to the corral a turkey over there look at him go got a big old gobbler he's going to drink water out of the water tank So the next pasture we're working, it's 35 pairs, it's one of our bigger ones. They need two bales of hay anyway, and we got the three-point ball hitch on this tractor, so we're like, well, if we're bringing them hay, we might as well bring them this, and vice versa, because we're gonna need them. And also about 400 more of those. Anybody got some? Well, it's a little past noon. We're gonna get some lunch. Uh, Uncle Jeff is gonna help us with these next groups as well, and he's, he's busy right now, so we'll be getting him in a little bit. Oh, hopefully those clouds stick around and maybe dump five inches of rain on us. That would be cool. We're gonna feed these bales, get the corral folded out.
not that one yet. Hey. Mm. Mm. Come down the second lane. Yep. through them fast and when we were getting them down here one calf squirted through the fence so we got to get one more in everybody else is done so it just so happens that last one that squirted through the fence that we just got in that was number 130. That's the one that I treated about a month ago. It had a really swollen back leg. You can see it's moving good now. We need some AC in here. Woo. So with that, we worked just short of 200 critters, and hopefully we don't have to deal with pneumonia calves anymore. I think we did some good today. We got a jog to go now. We've been working them down a little bit, shutting the four wheelers off, hanging out, letting these cows eat this green grass. They deserve it. I just wish, I wish we could let them out in these pastures, but they'd eat it so fast. I keep telling dad if we didn't have cows, you know, on the crop side, I wouldn't worry about it. I hate the thought of having to sell these cows if we can't find feed or make feed. I ask y'all, send a prayer up for all these cattle ranchers that are having a hard time with feed. Are you feeling kind of cowboyish today? Because we did a lot of cowboying. Yeah. Now that you mention it. Yeah. I don't want to do this every day but once in a while it's all right. I think the song of the day should be like a rhinestone cowboy from Glen Campbell. What do you say there, sir? Sounds like a hoot and a half. Hoot and a half. I reckon. Glen Campbell was a really talented man. Yep. Song of the day? That's a song of the day, peoples. I got a jug of, well, it's not that. It's full of gasoline. Why? We're gonna go home, we're gonna mow the lawn with the brand new 2023 Toro 
Z Master 2000 60 inch deck 23.5 horsepower I think turbo diesel exhaust engine nah, I'm just adding words now but there's some low spots in the yard with a lot of with a decent amount of grass that'll be fun to mow I hope that's enough I feel like I'm on a spaceship. looks pretty good aside from the bare spots weeds anyway I got a lot left to go 60 inch deck will take care of it anyway hopefully this isn't my last time mowing the lawn we just need a rain not much more to it than that anyway tomorrow we're gonna move into uh, soybean planting we got corn planting done last video got the cattle work today they look beautiful hopefully we can find some feed for them thanks for watching folks we really we really do appreciate it thank you a ton Love to see you next time. Have a good one. We're looking for that. I suppose those aren't worth nothing. <laughs>